I'm Dylan Black. Hello. The Sultans of String Christmas Caravan with special guests is coming December 19th. With all the details, we are joined right now by uh, Chris McCool, Sultans of String. Nice to have you here, sir. Great to be here. Thanks so much. Well, okay, so uh, I have the album, and it's the third Christmas Caravan, correct? Yes, okay. it's our third season doing it. Okay, but you've been doing this, the Sultans of String, since 2007. That's when we uh, originally formed and created our first album. So this is number six. We've been on quite a journey around the world since then. Ooh, okay, <laughs> lots of details to get to here. Uh, now, you are from Ottawa, um, an Ottawa musician. You've got lots of connections. So let's name drop here. Sure, perhaps. absolutely. And that's part of the reason why I'm so excited about the show at Shentman Hall, which is a real jewel here in the Ottawa area. And it was an opportunity for me to bring together some of my favorite Ottawa performers, um, Rebecca Campbell mm -hmm. and Lynn Miles, two uh, folk singer-songwriters that are joining us for the show. Um, I used to go see them. I don't know if you remember um, Rasputin's Cafe on Bronson. Hmm. It's where I really uh, first fell in love with folk music, and I would go see Rebecca and Lynn Miles perform there all the time, and it was really a very formative part of my musical upbringing here in Ottawa. Yeah. And then we've got uh, Kelly Lee Evans, fantastic uh, jazz course. singer. We've got oh, yeah. Christine St. Pierre. Um, because I thought it would be wonderful to bring in uh, a French, uh, French connection and the amazing uh, husband and wife duo of uh, Twin Flames bringing Beautiful. in their unique harmonies and, and approach to music. Which is, so in a way, we've created a little bit of a festival for Christmas Caravan. My goodness. Okay, so what kind of songs? Obviously Christmassy. Well, yeah, yeah. definitely Christmassy. Holiday season. <laughs> yeah. um, so with Sultans of String, we love playing world music bringing in sounds from around the globe. So we've got a, a Cuban percussionist, Rosendo Chende Leon, bringing in those sounds as well as other world music sounds. We've got uh, rumba flamenca guitar playing of Kevin La Liberté, who's toured around the world with artists like Jesse Cook and mm. Cross Canada Tour with the Chieftains. Um, we've got Drew Burston on bass, who's uh, performed with big pop acts like Chantal Kraviazuk and Melanie Doan. And wow. We've got Eddie Payton on guitar. Um, myself on violin, so we really love bringing together everything from gypsy jazz to rumba flamenca, Arabic rhythms from my uh, childhood background, and of course being a fiddle player we've got to bring in some East Coast celtic -y type flavor, so it's a real mishmash and we thought it'd be um, fun to bring in all the energy and drive of those world music rhythms to the Christmas music that people mm -hmm. like okay. to hear and sing. It's going to be a heck of a night, as I mentioned, <laughs> December 19th at Shankman Arts Centre, and here's a sample of what you'll get, Jingle Bells right now. Okay, as I mentioned, so uh, Christmas Caravan is the name of the album, I mean the album that you've produced, so why is it different from other holiday albums? Well, I, I think that multicultural approach uh, to global rhythms, bringing that into the Christmas repertoire is really interesting. But also we tried to go really back to the roots of each of these songs because some of the Christmas repertoire is the most beautiful repertoire that exists and, and you know, we would beat the song back to the studs and figure out what made that song so special that it's being able, being able to last for 100, 200 years, 300 years, and, uh, and, and recreate it in a new and fresh way. One of the songs that we, we discovered along the way, um, here in Ontario, we learned a song called the Huron Carol in mm -hmm. school. But those lyrics that everybody knows these days, that's a complete rewrite of the song. So we went back into the archives and found the original Huron Wendat lyrics from the 1600s and a university professor who did a direct translation into English and then we teased that back into song form. So people can hear this important piece of history uh, with fresh ears as though for the first time. Mm. Okay, so it's a lot of traditional carols, but there's twists on many of them. There's always a twist with us yeah. because there's no point just doing it the same old way. Yeah, okay. <laughs> and uh, you're also uh, celebrating uh, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa. It's not just about Christmas season when it comes to the show. I, that's one of the things I learned from uh, performing uh, in schools, doing education programming, and like I'm doing this week, uh, right now, uh, this week, I'm in the schools with a, an organization called MASK, mm -hmm. uh, Multicultural Artists for School and communities. They're a non-profit organization that connects artists like myself with uh, schools and it's a really great way for kids uh, to get exposure to different sounds and different things they may have not heard before. Um, and when you're performing in front of a school you might see maybe uh, uh, people 
that speak 50 different languages at home represented in, in the school community. So for me, it's really important to try and be as inclusive as possible and to reflect um, reflect some of the culture uh, and the background of the students on stage. Mm -hmm. And then when we perform in public with Sultans of String, I still have that, that mindset yeah. of trying to be as inclusive as possible. And this is a very cool opportunity to see this album performed live. For the it's, most part. <laughs> it's pretty fun. It's pretty yeah. fun for us. For for diehard Sultans of String fans, they know us predominantly as an instrumental band, but mm -hmm. this is a show where there's a lot of singing involved. Everyone sings a lot of the time, and it's it's pretty joyous. That's super cool. Okay, as mentioned, Thursday, December 19th, 8 p.m. at the beautiful Shankman Arts Center in Orleans. Chris McCool, thank you very much for being here today. Thank you very much. Sultans of String. There you go. More daytime coming up.